Three teens are out of the hospital tonight after their car flipped upside down in Harrison Township last night. But apparently the question is, were they playing Nerf Wars when all of this has take, took place? I should say that that's really what one of their moms actually told 911. WCPO 9 News reporter Valerie Lyons is live in Harrison tonight. Valerie, uh, the mom wants to clear things up now. Yeah, Craig, the mom says yes, her daughter was playing Nerf Wars, but that was earlier. She says the 15 year old was actually on her way back home with her friends in the car when they pulled in to the driveway, and that is when the car behind them crashed into them. There was a car wreck. Chalk it up to adrenaline, chalk it up to panic. This Harrison Township mom says it's all a misunderstanding. The car that got hit is flipped upside down. She didn't want to speak on camera Wednesday, but she did let us on her yard to see the aftermath. Tire treads, debris, and a toppled mailbox. But the mom insists her daughter wasn't battling it out with Nerf guns when this happened, despite how her 911 call may have sounded. They're young kids, so they were playing Nerf Wars. They pulled into the driveway and they took out the mailbox. She says the 15 year old and her two friends were on their way home from playing Nerf Wars and at around 945 the Hamilton County Sheriff's Office says the teenage boy driving behind the girls didn't slow down when they did. So he hit the back of their car, rolling it on its top, trapping the girls inside. HCSO says the fire department got them all out and they were taken to the hospital injured, but they'll be OK. And I was actually able to speak with the daughter of this mom here. She was wearing a neck brace, but again, she is expected to be okay. Just a little shaken from all of it. Now, I did ask the Hamilton County Sheriff's Office if these teens were in fact playing Nerf Wars when this all happened. They say they can't confirm anything as of yet. For now, live in Harrison Township, Valerie Lyons, WCPO 9 News. All right.